Cardi B just admitted to the most trifling, disgusting, low down thing any human can ever admit to. While Cardi B was on IG Live, Offset took to the comment section to alert the world that Cardi B cheated on him. And not only did she sleep with somebody else, but she slept with that other person while she was pregnant with his baby and still married to him. But Offset had accused Cardi B of cheating in the past, and he admitted that he was wrong and she never cheated. I mean, Cardi B has also been accused of cheating by a rapper called Bia, and you know she provided some receipts to prove that she wasn't cheating. I, I, like, I don't know. So I just assumed this was one of those situations where like it's just rumors, Offset is in his feelings, and this would not amount to anything. Well, I was really wrong because apparently they were having conversations back and forth via text. After Offset wrote that in her comment section, Offset was also promising to expose the text messages and the receipts that proved that she cheated on him while pregnant with his baby. Now, Cardi B being faced with all these receipts and, you know, the evidence right in her face, Cardi B took to Twitter to pretty much confess and say, yeah, I did it and did i guess in her head cheating while she was pregnant with offset's baby is her ultimate get back and her admitting to it on twitter is her being a boss babe and yeah he cheated i can cheat too girls can do it too that's fine and dandy but when you really look at the landscape of exactly what took place what cardi b just did one admitting to that is <laughs> Is devaluing yourself. Yo, there's no way anybody can ever look at Cardi B with any level of respect ever again. Like, she just lost all respect, respect that anybody would ever have for her. That's one. Secondly, though, you see, she has broken up her home forever. You see, if they have a divorce, huge argument, things don't go their way, they get a divorce. You know, yeah, things may be bad for a little minute, but ultimately, bruh, they'll be able to go back to having a healthy co-parenting relationship. But you think you're about to have a healthy co-parenting relationship with a man who you just admitted to that you slept with another man while you was pregnant with his baby? Yo, do Cardi B understand that that right there is going to make that man literally despise you for the rest of his life? That man now views you as his absolute worst enemy on earth. How do you co-parent with that? You can't at all. Now, to add insult to injury, Cardi B hopped on IG Live to, I guess, rub it in, um, you know, and brag about sleeping with other men while pregnant. One more f***ing thing before I say goodbye, goodnight to all of y'all, because it's 2 a.m. and I have a lot of things to do tomorrow. One more f***ing thing before I get the f*** on out of here, all right? I just want to let, I just want to let my know one, right? I don't give a fuck if a nigga talking about, oh, I'm going to expose you. Oh, I'm going to put them text messages that I saw through your phone. I don't give a fuck. I will expose my own tea. I don't give a fuck. I don't care. I don't care. Do that. You should be happy. You know what you should be? You, you know what you should be happy? You should be happy that I'm a real gangster. At the end of the day. I'm a real gangster bitch, and I'm a soft. So one thing I'm not gonna do to you ever is entertaining them your ops that be in my DMs. She claims she's a solid woman. Now her reasoning for why she calls herself solid is because she's not sleeping with the men who want to kill Offset, huh? Yo, I don't know about y'all, bro. Yo, I don't think you can ever call yourself a solid woman, bro. If you sleep and cheat on your husband while you are pregnant with his baby, I don't care what type of caution you exercise, bruh. I don't care what ops you choose not to entertain, bruh. The minute you sleep with another man while pregnant with your husband, baby, bruh, you is not thorough. You is not real at all. Trying to suck my I will never do that because the op to you is bigger that wants you dead. And I don't want you dead because my kids love the f out of you, out of you. My kids love you down. So I will never do that. And I really follow gangster. I really follow street codes. I will never be a lame ass bitch that f with a nigga op just to get back. No, I don't have to do that. I just got a nigga that's better than you. However, I don't give a f You can expose whatever the f you want to expose. I'm exposing myself. 
here. I told you when a Libra start Libraing, we really don't give a fuck. Now goodbye. Now this where things get really entertaining. So the low life POS Cardi B who slept with another man while pregnant with her husband's baby. She then go on live to speak about how much better she is than Offset and how Offset isn't on her level. I'll be real, bro. At this point, bro, I don't think a dumpster, like an absolute dumpster can inanimate object, I don't think that dumpster can is beneath Cardi B's level, bro. Any human being who will stoop to this level of sleeping with another man while pregnant with your husband's baby, you are the lowest of the lowest and it doesn't get lower than you. So her comment on Instagram to speak about how she's much better than Offset and how Offset isn't on her level, to me, it's just, it's just dumb, bro. Like, you gave this man three kids. <laughs> bro, y'all are on the same level. At this point, bro, I'll be real, bro. Yeah, I think Offset may be a tad bit better than Cardi B. And I know Offset a cheater, too. I'm too much woman for you. You know what I'm saying? I'm too much of a ball bitch for you. And I've always been too good for you. I've been too good for you. I've been too good for anything that is associated to you. So you got other to make yourself feel better. Because I make you feel so low about yourself. Because I don't make you feel like I'm you're that nigga in this home. So that's what you got to do. So you out here trying to hurt my feelings because you in the next. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Because them hoes ain't pussy ain't good enough that I be having you crashing out. All weekend. You was mad happy today when I fucking called you today. And the only reason why I got I, I called you today is because I'm trying to change my son's school. And I need your approval. Other than that, fuck you. I don't care. Fuck the world. Fuck my ops. I'm gonna fuck your ops. Uh -huh, that's why I'm fucking your ops. Yeah, of course, because you don't you don't you don't you don't move with integrity. You're not a street. That's what you do. I'll be real, yo. A chick smash another man while pregnant with my baby? And I'm all of a sudden, I'm a celebrity and she's a... Oh, no, 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 no. Yo, at, yo, at this point, bro, I can't blame Offset for what he decides to do. And I'm talking about Offset can do whatever he decides to do. And I won't say a word. Offset can crash out to the max. I won't say a word, bro. Because this right here is level of evilness that I don't even think is imaginable. I don't even, yo, I don't even think that there were women. Now, I've heard rumors of some women doing this, but I didn't even know this was a thing that women even fathom. That a woman would even sit down and think, yo, I'm, yo, I'm eight months pregnant. My kid is, is fully developed. Let me go get cream pie by another ninja? Huh? With my fetus? About three inches away? Oh, no. This is trifling. Now, what's kind of odd, too, though, is that the female rapper Bia was going around telling people that Cardi B was cheating on Offset. Cardi B heard this, and she came on IG Live and did all the dramatics about how no Bia is lying and she would never how like how could she cheat on offset if she cheat on offset y'all would know who it is here's cardi b explaining how it's impossible she could ever cheat on offset and this was about three months ago a couple of weeks later a couple of weeks later and everything some girl from Atlanta, she's me and Offset's friend. She's me and Offset's friend, and she hit somebody up from my team, like, yo. She hit somebody up from my team, like, yo, um, there's this rumor going around that there's like a, a tape of Cardi, like a, a sex tape of Cardi. And I was like, me? impossible bitch impossible there's n there's none i'll pay i told him like it's like a sex tape of me i'll pay somebody a million dollars cash i would even wire it i'll cash it don't even send it to my phone don't send it to my phone put it on social media put it out put it out because i know me y'all know me yeah you know what i'm saying it's like whatever so then i'm like fuck that i want to talk 
I, I, I hit up the girl myself. I'm like, yo, where's this rumor coming from? And it's like, yeah, it's coming from Shorty. It's coming from her. And it's like, huh? So I'm like, what do you mean? It's like, yeah, she showed the video to this producer that he's very close to Offset. Like, they're like this. And that she saw, and she showed it to another rapper. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to get to the bottom of it. So I called the producer, but he talks to Offset. And he told Offset, I ain't seen the video, but Shorty's saying that she got some shit on your bitch. And if your, your girl, like, replied back, like, like, to whatever the fuck she put out, she's going to post the video or some shit like that. I'm like, all right, whatever. So I called the rapper, too, and the rapper is like... Bia was going around Atlanta showing people video of Cardi B getting piped out, allegedly, by another man. Cardi B heard about this. She claimed it was all fake. Bia was lying. But she took the extra mile to investigate this, though. <laughs> right? Bia is capping. Oh, I'm going to sue Bia. The lawsuit never came, by the way. Now, a lot of us just assumed Bia was cloud chasing or capping because the video never came out. But I'll be real. This time around? This time around? Are we saying Bia is lying now? Are we saying Bia is capping? Are we saying Bia is a cloud chaser now? We're not saying it no more, right? Because a woman who will sleep with another man while pregnant with her husband's baby, there's nothing that woman won't do. There's nothing you can tell me right now that Cardi B did that I will say, nah, even Cardi won't do that. She will do it all. Now, she goes on to deny it and claiming Bia is lying on her vagina. She would never, where's the receipt? She's going to sue, et cetera, et cetera, man. Now, in hindsight, bruh, we can pretty much read through all the BS. Cardi B is a deplorable human being. And this, this, and that. You could, you could come at me at any angle. You going to lie on my pussy? Bitch, you lying on my fucking pussy? When you lie about my pussy, I'm going to sue you. And you got to come with receipts. And not, only, not social media receipts. You got to come with court receipts. Because one thing you're, gonna, you're not going to do, you're not going to lie on my pussy. And you're not going to lie about me stepping out on my shit. There has been so many rumors about me. And I got so many fucking ops. I got so many ops. I got bloggers. There's ops. And, and oh, yeah, yeah. And then she's saying this, right? Then she posted this on her little Finsta. Hold up. I got it. She talking about, bitch, I'm not Tasha K. <laughs> girl, ask Tasha K. She, came, she could even lie on my pussy, girl. She could even lie. Ask her. Tasha K could even lie on my pussy. So how are you lying on my pussy? Hold up. Mm -mm -mm. She talking about, this offense though. She talking about, good luck, you think I'm Tasha K. Watching that while being armed with the information we're currently armed with now, it's just insane, yo. Cardi B is one of the most deplorable, despicable, low-down human beings I think to ever live. This is trifling. This is the most trifling thing anybody can ever do. Y'all let me know in the comment section, man, what do you guys think about this, all right? Do you guys believe this? And if you guys, you know, want to watch something else that's really unbelievable, Click on this video right here. This new Kamala Harris story is frightening. It's very scary and unbelievable. Click on this video right here to find out what I'm talking about. I'm going to see you guys in this video. I'm out of here, folks. Peace.